Hello and welcome back to Stoneherd. So, um, just as an update, this is, I think, the last video where I'm going to be away and thus not responding to comments. So after this, I should be able to take all comments. I think so, but I'm not 100% sure, but I'm pretty sure. Um, don't remember what was going on. I think, yeah, so we, I want to build this pretty quickly just because, um, we're not having a huge storage problem just because we have so many little stockpiles here and there, but it'd be nice to have a little centralized thing. Um, but to do that, we needed stone from here so that the stone mason could start working. So I guess we're just waiting for the hearthlings to gather enough stones that the stone mason can make. I guess it was the blacksmith hammer? Or was it? Was there a thing? I think we just need to get a little uh, stockpile of stone saved away. Yeah, let's just wait on that. Stop digging up minerals, gosh darn it. Just dig up stone. It's interesting the way it works, because the world's a block. Or, well, everything in the world is all, like, voxel-based. So, in most games where that's a thing, every time you mine one block, you get one thing. I'm not exactly sure how they calculate it, but... Perthlings only get one block for every however many blocks it is that they mine. Maybe, like... I don't know, 16 or something? How long is this thing? It seems to give one per, like, layer of them digging this. It could be, um, a little bit fewer than that, though. I'm not sure. Anyway, everyone seems to be... Was... I, I think the town got attacked? Or something? Everyone seems to be very hurt. Well, actually, that's just the military, and they're supposed to be hurt. Which, which sounds wrong, but whatever. You need to level up. How close are you? Oh, so close. Um, I think we have all the padded vests we need. Uh, so I could get a couple worker outfits. Um, I'll get one of those. And then sell that. I'm not sure if I want to sell our stone goods. Well, I guess I will. It's just, it's gonna require the guy to use up even more stone. Eh. But we get money for it. Which we could use to buy stone later, when the stone merchant guy comes along. Yeah, we definitely need to dig a little bit faster. So if you guys could just hurry up, that'd be excellent. Oh yeah, herbalist. You. Um, he does have to craft, but he doesn't have the required flowers. Which means... Oops. Oh, did we make it? <gasps> oh, we didn't make it anyway. If we did make it, that would be like... We got exactly enough. Okay, these wolves over here, I want those flowers. Is our military strong enough to fight those wolves? Eh, you could be healed a little bit Oh, so between the last episode and this episode, which was like a couple hours, well, not a couple hours, anyway, um, uh, I read that the reason that the stone- okay, so it was right before I ever started recording Stonehearth, like, the game that I played right before then, if they got damaged, or maybe it was halfway through even. Oh, it was probably halfway through actually. It was, I think it was an alpha 20. Um, if they got, if they were any bit damaged, they would lie down and the herbalist would heal them until they were fully healed. And then I think it's an update in alpha 21 that happened that as long as they have 50% of their health or more, they just get up and start walking. So I, I remember wondering why they started doing that and not knowing if it was a bug or if, if the game was just, it changed the way it did things, but that seems to be, is this tin? Yeah. That seems to be the case that, um, yeah, they just, they just get up even if they're not fully healed, which I still find sort of annoying and I was hoping that it was just a bug or something that they would work out, but oh well, um, oh we have a forge, oh we have a blacksmith. I forgot, I thought that we didn't have one. Anyway, um, so I should make some stuff. So yeah, that's why they keep getting up. So I'm just gonna have to, I mean, I always knew to expect that after it happened the first five or six times, but now I can know why it's like actually a thing. So it's at 50% or more, I believe. Um, let's have, yeah, let's, we have a lot of tin and copper. Well, actually not a ton of copper. Do we have any iron? Not a whole lot. I want to get as much iron as we can. Um, are they... Yeah, they're still mining. Okay, so, military, let me see your healths. Uh, let's get you guys to come over here. 
Actually, don't fight, just come over here. That guy's a little bit damaged, but I think he's the most damaged out of all of them. Yeah, he is. I think they can take on the wolves. Um, since the wolves don't really follow, I'm going to have them attack the wolves as best as they can. And if they get too damaged, I'll just take them back out. So I guess they'll first go after the most damaged wolf. Then they'll go after this guy. I really want those flowers. I mean, there's flowers up here too. But I also don't like the threat of wolves. Okay, they took, a they took out that first one pretty quickly. Now they just need to take out this one. And you. I wish he could get a little bit below. Thank you. Because once he's below 50%, then the herbalist can heal him. And he can get even more healed than he was before, potentially. What are they doing just standing around? Are they alright? What's- oh! Why didn't I get any notification? Did I? I did. Um... Okay. Okay, we can take a Varanus and Entlings. That's not the worst thing in the world, but where's um, our military? Oh, you guys are all the way down there, yeah. Why is it always that when you start attacking something that everything decides to... All the invaders happen. It's it's never, never uh, during a peaceful time. Maybe we should get the... Mm, not sure if we should get the Entlings first or not. That guy's gonna die, though. Um... Yeah, let's, let's have you retreat. Let's all... I, I should have waited until they joined up. Okay, and let's, let's, first, okay, you know what, let's go after the Entlings first. They probably, I'm not sure how much damage they do, but they die really quickly, so they might be the better choice. Just kill all the Entlings first. Come on, I can't click on these things. Okay, then you. Okay, now go after the Varanus. Uh, that guy is so badly damaged. I need a knight, but to get a knight, hmm. Um, I'll have... Ooh, is that guy gonna die? I'm wondering... I, I meant the Varanus when I said that guy, but that could easily go for my fighters, too. Um, you. I want you... Oh, I think you're knocked out. Oh, yeah, I want you to make that. Are you knocked out? Because it says rescue on you. Um... Yeah. That's not cool. Yeah, they're taking him out. They might... Uh, they might die, though. Okay, you know what? Let's let's not leave this up to chance. Let's have the town attack. Hopefully they can run over here before... Yeah. Before that. <laughs> Ooh, this is not a good fight. It's always... I knew that was gonna happen. Decide to attack something and then something's gonna come from the other end. It's like... It's like the game understands when you're attacking something. Like when you go out and attack something as opposed to something attacking you and it decides then to have everything else attack you. So yeah, they're gonna survive this, but just barely. And watch another Varanus, or maybe a, you know, Goblin Horde is just gonna come out of nowhere because of this. They're gonna make it, I think, but it's gonna be a close one. Ooh, do we have enough beds to house all these dead people? Ah, uh, we do. Okay, so it's just you, I think, that- oh wait, there's also you. Okay, everyone, everyone, fix everybody. Put everyone to sleep. Um, no. That's a bad deal. Come on. Come on. Hopefully this isn't- ah, This is a really bad fight. Never attack anything is the moral of this story. I feel like that could have gone a lot better. Yeah, if I didn't attack the wolves, that would have definitely been a lot better, but if I had also, like, gathered everyone before they started fighting the Varanus, that would have been better, too. And if this town wasn't so long and drawn out. But oh well. Okay, cool. This almost- this could be a very good, uh, hospital area, but it's- I want that to be a thing, and I don't think it is a thing yet, where you can assign- like, this is going to be where all the sick people stay. I think that would be awesome. They had that in Nemoria, I remember, and I liked that. Even though I never used the hospital, because it was almost always a bad idea, um, you could assign a certain area where only the sick people would go for the doctors to treat them. So it made things a lot easier. Here, anyone could just go anywhere. Uh, and I remember they were even stealing each other's beds. Oh, thankfully, the herbalist is still alive. Yeah, so they were they were even um, 
stealing each other's beds when they were sick. Like, I remember this bed was owned by whoever it was, and then a sick person slept in it. So that's not cool. I guess the carpenter, because that looks like the carpenter. Go on, gather, gather those, those flowers. I might switch one of these. No, we hardly have enough food, but I want to switch some of the- mm, I'm gonna do it. You know what? We need flowers more than we need more hearthlings and food. Because, um, I want them to have more flowers so that the herbalist can help people more. In fact, I'm gonna move this down over here. Uh, I think that's alright. Um, because I really want these people to heal up quickly. Darn. Yup, that was pretty bad. They might have come from the cave. Which, um... I think I it's a pretty easy fix. I'm gonna tell them to make a wooden tunnel door. Actually, we could probably make a stone tunnel door and it might be a little bit safer. I don't know if it is or not. It says it's meant for um, sealing off mining tunnels, so let's go with that. Uh, I did not move it. And then I'll put this up top too, because I think that's important. Ooh, farmer leveled up. What can you do now? Wheat? I think she was able to do that before. I don't think she gets anything at level 4. I think it's level, level 5 of the trees. <sighs> this poor town. At least he's finally doing his job and healing everybody. He might even level up during it. If he levels up, I'm not going to immediately promote him to cleric until everyone's not dead anymore. I think that's the priority right now. Yup. What are you doing? Where's he running to? Are there flowers up here? Oh no, there's health potions. Er, not health potions. There's uh, bandages. Quite a few. Um, We can even put just for right now. I keep saying just for right now. This stuff is probably going to stay here for like decades. Um, Is that healing items? There. So that way he doesn't have to walk too far away. Because I feel like that, that wastes a lot of time. Oh, almost everyone's healed again. They're not great, but they're they're doing better. Uh, I think everyone's fine. I hope I didn't forget anyone. Is everyone in the mine okay? Because there could be somebody dead just laying down that I'm not seeing, but it looks like everybody's fine. I could probably... Yeah. Every, everybody looks like they're not dying. Oh, that reminds me. Um, I took them off of their jobs, and I want to put them back on their jobs. That might have caused that issue before. Oh yeah, where they were just standing around and not doing anything, that's probably... Yes! You leveled up and everyone's healed. Which means, uh, you, you lucky, lucky person, get to craft one of these that we can't craft because we need a weaver. Oh boy. Oh boy. Um, let's have the carpenter craft a weaver spindle. And then I think I'll just give it to the last person who doesn't have a job temporarily, just so they can make the leather. Just so we can have, um, a cleric. I think that's important. Um, and I guess he can make a couple bandages. I don't want him to run out of flowers before he makes this. I guess he'll just have enough flowers, so it's fine. And then they can- oh, well, <laughs> there's one flower left over there. That flower used to be such an issue. I mean, it was a different flower and it's deleted now, but... Huh. We're growing a lot of turnips. It might switch over to- well, this is gonna be flowers, so I guess that's an alright amount of turnips to grow. Okay, everyone's- everyone's back to normal. The town looks about normal right now. Um, not everyone's dead. So that's pretty cool. I just need them to heal a little bit faster. I think by virtue of standing near them, the herbalist might heal some people. Uh, with his natural regeneration, wherever he is. Is it this guy? I can see you based on the mohawk. He has that, uh... Nope, it's just him. Only he has improved health regeneration. We don't need that. Uh, let's promote our last jobless person to being a weaver. Wait, she liked something. Was that having pets or something? What was that? Ever since Mana Ember saved their raccoon from mortal danger, they've been inseparable. Oh, so she has a pet. That scared me. I thought that was, um, invaders for a second. 
Oh, why is that notification still there? Oh, uh, not good enough. Ooh, what? Oh, no, no, no. What is it? Okay, it's just a stone golem. I think we can take this. Hopefully. It's gonna do quite a bit of damage. Didn't I tell them to attack it? Maybe I can't see the attack thing because it's under some stone. Yeah, they're, they're going towards it. Okay, since you leveled up, uh, we can start making some of this. Let's actually just go with three. And then we can finally make some better weapons. Um, hmm. Let's go with, um, let's make two for right now. I want them, I really want them to make an iron mace. Uh, and then I'll place down, because I just noticed she didn't have an anvil. So I'll place that down. That'll be good. How's, how's the fight going? I wish I could see, oh, look at that. Uh, that guy's not doing well, but hopefully he'll get healed by the herbalist well enough. Yeah, this isn't the best fight in the world. They're doing alright, though. Why do they have wooden swords? They have stone mauls. They just drop them? You guys are all high enough levels to use those. They're kinda being stupid right now. Are they gonna be able to kill it? Jeez, just get a hit. See, the problem is he hits them before they hit him, and then they run away. You know, this isn't working. Let's just- let's just have the town fight off the rest. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, yeah, because you're gonna be dead now. Okay. We're good. Uh, let's heal everybody. Good fight, good fight, everyone. Hmm. Not- not a good situation right here. Um, do we have the weaver spindle yet? Oh, no, no, because I didn't tell the weaver to make it. You. I only want the thing that makes leather. Which I need that for, but I already have it. So, weaver workbench. Let's make that. Um. Yeah. I guess it's a mad dash to get that cleric to heal everybody. Although, again, I might keep him as an herbalist because these people are dead. So, come on. Uh, did we get it? Yes. Okay. I'll put this down near where all of the silkweed is. Although this person's only going to be a weaver for exactly as long as it takes to make one of those leather thingies. Um, hopefully we can make that. Come on. Where's the... you're the weaver. Somebody else gonna put it down for you? Come on. And then you, are you- you need to pick up a better- Oh, you're dead. Darn, we're never gonna get that. I don't know why I keep clicking on it. Okay. Um, so this is really a precarious situation to be in, but in the next episode, um, I'm gonna try to make, um, the leather piece of thingy, uh, so that we can have the cleric, or so we can have the herbalist turn into a cleric, and we need to get all these people healed up. Once we have the cleric, um, well, once these people are healed, the cleric won't be, oh, we can make the cleric. I don't want to make him before, because I want him to still wait on these people and make sure they can, like, get out of bed first. Um, but yeah, we need the leather for that, which, which we will do, yeah, as soon as possible. Actually, I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna do it right now, just so I don't forget. Come on. Where's the- okay, you're the- you look a lot like the blacksmith. Just make that. Awesome. And then you, number one priority, oops, is to make- that's already your number one priority. Come on. Come on, Mr. Mr. Herbalist. I guess he's healing someone first. Does he need to heal anyone? Oh, I guess he needs to heal him. Let's just gather all this nonsense. That's a weird type of wood. Juniper, pine, and oak. Uh, juniper? Oh, look at that. 
Okay, just just heal him the rest of the way. Is he gonna try to heal him again, or is he- Thank you, make that. Come on, you can do it. Oh no, I think he's making a bandage first. That's really annoying. Just use it, or- or just make the next thingy. Oh, we can't heal him immediately because that whole recently treated thing. You know, the recently treated with the whole after 50% they won't stay in bed thing, like those combined makes it really difficult. Oh no, you're gonna heal him using the bandage that was all the way over there. You know what? Let's not have that happen. That's, that's, that's annoying. There was one right there. You could've used that one. Unless he's using that to... No? You're using that to heal. Are you healing this guy? But he's at 50% or more. No, you didn't use it, because he's not healed. Anyway, go make your thingy. Come on. Ugh. You're making the ending of this video so long, I just, I just wanted you to craft one thing. That's already crafted. Like, you just have to put two pieces together. Thank you. Good. You look like you have everything you need. Come on. Run faster. That guy's not doing well. Uh, I'm not sure if he'll be able to, like, treat him while he's a cleric, but... I think he might. I don't know. They Clerics have, like, that aura around them that heals everybody. So he might. Come on, buddy. Oh, he already got up. Oh, no, but he's eating. Anyway, did you make the... No. No, you didn't. Because that would just be too hard, wouldn't it? Uh, let's buy some wood. So we have some extra. Sell some decorations. Cool. Come on, just craft the- literally the one thing. Just- just the one thing, just craft it. This guy hates me, and I hate him back. We should name him Kibbit again. Uh, the- the cleric. Because I always- the clerics are the ones that I hate the most because they seem to do the most, um, ridiculous things. Although he's- he's better healed now, so I guess I shouldn't be too upset. You. Come on. There we go, finally! You! You are now a cleric. And then, mana. You are now a nothing. Because you're too stupid to be a weaver. I don't know how you managed to make that leather thing. Great, okay, everyone's getting healed, and now we have like a permanent healer, and none of them are grabbing their good weapons for whatever reason. Maybe because they're not- oh dear. Oh dear. You know what? It's been too long, so we'll deal with that in the next video. So I will see you guys then when this whole town probably dies because it's a stone golem. Bye!